everyone, Midlife Gamers, thank you for joining me. We are here to take a quick look at Arcade Legend, which had another DLC update this week. We have three new arcade machines. Uh, it's the first paid DLC. It costs £2.26, I believe I paid. Um, and the three arcade games are tying with Baytech. So we have Big Bass Wheel. Quick Drop, and also Sink It, which is a bit like Beer Pong. So we're going to have a quick look at all three of the arcade games. Now this is a bit like a, a sort of Lucky Dip Win Tokens machine, this one. What you can do, if you pull the lever down slowly, you can start it spinning and then pull it right down, get a real spin on it. It's got a nice little animation of water splashing there and the idea is, is you get 80 tickets you get experience points as well it's quite good for getting experience points if you want to level up a bit like the uh, mega spin wheel so let's do one more i've never got 1000 or 2000 on this i've come close but there's such a narrow margin as you'll see there between the you know winning big and winning four tickets there we go i am addicted to it after so <laughs> i think it's a the chance of winning oh there we go look oh come on that's how far away i was from winning big so that's the big bass wheel this is quick drop which you have to you have a certain amount of time certain amount of balls and to get any, you have to time it right to try and get, if you can get over 20, then you'll get tickets. You can see there, I've got 13, 14, I'm running out of time. Oh no, how many did I get? Oh no. How many did I get over 20? No, 16. I won 20 tokens, basically. 20 tickets, I mean. There we go. So it's all about timing it. Which. There we go, that's better. Oh! Oh no, come on. I'll time up. That must be over. Over 20. So did we get 50? Yes, we did. 25. So if you get... The maximum you get, by the looks of it, that they think is... Well... Oh no! So the more games they add, the the more I'm returning to this, and the more fun I'm having. The only thing I would say to the developers, it's like games, is the developers. Oh, I had loads to. That was quite a good ratio again. Twenty-one. I had seventeen balls left is uh, like games of the developers the only thing I would say is uh, I've got loads of machines that I've bought and loads of furniture but I'm already over the limit 350 and I've got all this space here that I'd like to fill out so I don't know if there's a possibility that the developers can add more space you have each machine takes up a certain amount of boxes so the smaller arcades will take up 10 i think the bigger ones take up like um, 15 or 20. so this is the third game called sink it which is basically beer pong you, you have to try and bounce the balls yes the most I've got is nine. I've never 
never max this so I'd never I don't know what actually happens if I should be lucky enough to oh come on oh come on yes Oh, come on. No. Eight. So, again, this is quite good. So, you get 100 uh, tickets, which you could, if you remember, the collect tickets, which allows you to buy um, additional items, like such as clothing, music, and bowling balls at the moment. Come on. Yes. Oh, there we go. Oh, we were on a roll then. Oh, I can't get that front one. Oh, come on. Yes. Oh, I thought that was going in then. Oh, come on. Right, one to go. Oh. Oh. Yes! Oh, we st we continue. That's what happens. So I've done it. So is that it? So you, you just win tokens for doing it. So if you complete it, you just win tokens. I wondered if it would continue playing. Yes. So that's the three new games. I'm continuing to... Maybe I'll be able to... I've got 2,000, so I've levelled up to level 12. Um, still can't quite... I've got next... We're 85, so we're 5,000 away from levelling up there on the ticket. So we can buy some clothes. We've got 250. We can do a different hat, different eyes, different glasses. So good. Oh, that's hair. So we've got like a David Bowie type makeup. We've got like the old police glasses there. And got some nice t shirts there. That's quite a nice one. Uh, can't get any more music at the moment. We've got to level up to 17. So the incentive is to sort of carry on playing the games yourself and you can then open up more items I would say at the moment my favourite <laughs> I love the wheel I love the beer pong and my most frustrating one is the balloon buster as I'll show you trying to do this I find really tricky line it up and then Trying to get the right height. Ah, oh, it's too low, I think. Oh no, it was slightly too high. Look how tight that is. That is so close. So that's one of my f the most frustrating ones. Um, yeah, I'm loving it. As you can see, I've changed the layout a little bit and made it a bit more like an arcade rather than <laughs> somebody's basement. I started putting machines in the middle. I'd like to quite extend that if possible. Sort of maybe bring it this way a bit and extend it out. Put some more machines in the middle there. Extend that out to here somewhere. And then start building more up here. So who knows? What machines? I keep finding these tokens. I've got to grab them. I've got to catch them all. So who knows what will be next? But yes. So the first paid DLC. It's two pound twenty-six. It's a Baytech tie, and you've got three machines: big bass, big bass wheel, quick drop, and sink it. Great additions, I think, and. It's adding to the arcade, add a lot of colour to them. I'd like I like the actual design of the machines. They're obviously 
exactly the same as you would find in the arcade so that helps and yes bring on more i say i can't wait to see what they do next so thank you for joining me if you like what i do <laughs> and my videos then please hit the like hit the subscribe and i will catch you in the next one cheers for watching thank you bye bye